a couple of days ago, I got in my uh, new Bluetooth. It's uh, SMH10R by Sina. Um, so that day, I got it. I, I set up my um, phone to the Bluetooth, but I didn't set up my iPod yet. But uh, in the box, you get a couple of these, which is like tells you how to get to the firmware and stuff like that. How to upgrade it. You get the user's manual. Uh, you get Velcro for the battery. The battery sits on the back of your helmet. Well, it can sit on the back of your helmet. That's what he suggested, anyway. Um, you get a flexible mic, or whatever you call this one. Here's the battery. Here's the car charger for the whole the whole um, unit. You got another mic. You can bend it in different ways. Stay stiff. You have speakers. Um, this is speakers right here. I already put Velcro on them on the back of them. <coughs> so here's the speakers right here. Um, I put Vel Velcro on them yesterday. I was going to put it on the helmet yesterday, but I changed my mind. Here's the Bluetooth unit itself. It's small and it has uh, three connectors. These three connectors go to the mic, the um, battery, and the uh, mic, battery, and the speakers. And all of them are uh, different sizes, so you can't like confuse them and mix them up. Oh yeah, uh, the main unit has a middle button where the the name is, right here. Then it has a plus and minus, and you do everything through that. It's Velcro for um, the unit, for this. And then these are mic covers, and there's something else in here. Oh, Velcro stickers. Uh, the opposite side. And uh, these are the opposite sides of the Velcro for the speakers. I forgot I had those. And then the last thing is the, the power cord right here. I still have it hooked up to my, my computer. And that way you can upgrade your firmware or um, you can even charge your battery and stuff like that through that. So let me set this up so I can add my. Um, and my iPod right here. This is going to be my music right here. Alright, to turn it on, you hold the middle button and the plus button at the same time for a second. Okay. Hello. As you, you can hear, it just said hello to me. Uh, it starts blinking to let you know it's on. Alright, to get to the options, this is probably like the hardest thing of it all. Is you have to hold it for 10 seconds and it'll tell you what, um, which uh, categories you're in. But the first two times I tried it, um, I didn't hold it long enough. And for, as soon as I heard something, I let it go. And then you have to wait. So make sure you hold it down for 10 seconds. Intercom, Perry. Universal intercom pairing. Configuration menu. Then you get the configuration menu, then you press over with Phone a plus. Pairing. Multi point pairing. Phone selected pairing. Media selected pairing. Okay, so now it's on media selected pairing. You go to your iPod and you find Bluetooth. And as soon as I find settings, Turn your Bluetooth on, and you gotta find it in here. There's the headset right there. Then you pair it. Probably can't see any of that. But there you go. Your headset is paired. Uh, I don't even know how to turn.
turn my hand. So it's not even focusing, so you see it anyway. But, <laughs> um, now it's paired. So if I wanted to listen to music to it, I can do it. Um, I think this thing can take up to three devices at the same time. So you could do, let's say if you had a standalone GPS, you could use a standalone GPS with the phone and some music. Or you could just use your phone with the music. So instead of having, which I have my phone and then I have an iPod, you could just have your phone play all the music for you. But then you could have, uh, I think, up to three or four people in a conference call for us all, all senior users. Um, at the same time, it goes up to a, damn near a thousand feet a distance between each other. Um, you can play your music, and the person that's connected to you through the intercom, they can hear your music. Answer your phone calls and stuff like that, of course. Uh, so this should be good. Um, at first, I was just using my my headphones, sticking them in my helmet. But now, I got this. It should make it more comfortable ride and uh, easier to do. Since I've been able to control the, uh, I've been able to control which songs I'm listening to and all that. So I guess it's now to try to uh, set this whole thing up. <laughs> 